Now, um, quick update. Uh, we've been calling. Uh, we, we had this uh, chat yesterday about the Verge Media stuff, and um, uh, bizarrely, today um, we had an engineer coming to sort out our, our internet. We've been calling, I think, for the past uh, three months. Um, there are problems on the street. This is this. This is that. Blah blah blah. We can't do it. Da 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 da. And then eventually now they send us an engineer. The engineer came and uh, said that uh, there was a problem on the street. So he swapped the ports over. Now our internet is back in business. And tomorrow, that will be on tomorrow's show, I'm going to call Virgin Media and we, walk, we want the money back. We want the money back for the three months because we could not have the amount of internet we deserve. And this is what you have to do. You just have to fight for the rights to become a president of the United Kingdom and America. That's what Trump did. He fought it. He went for it. He never gave up. And he became the president. And congratulations. I know it has nothing to do with Virgin Media, but this 4th of November did change my life because now I could even play at Wimbledon. I know it sounds great, uh, uh, crazy, but I actually theoretically could play at Wimbledon in maybe in 10 years in a double. If I put my mind to it, I might achieve it and I might actually do it. Everything is possible. Seriously, if this guy become the president of America, then I could play in five or 10 years in a double in Wimbledon, mixed double or the old double or whatever they call it, easily. Incredible. 